गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन सो वी आर डूइंग क्वालिटी इक्वेशन इन क्लास इलेवेंथ एंड यस्टरडे वी आर डूइंग दैट टॉप कॉन्सेप्ट रिड्यूसबिल टू द रिड्यूसबिल टू द इक्वेशन इन द क्वालिटिक फॉर्म सो टूडे वी विल कंटिन्यू दिस दिस कॉन्सेप्ट अगेन लेट एस टेक सम मोर क्वेश्चन टू रिड्यूज इन क्वालिटिक फॉर्म एंड देन सिंप्लीफाई लेट एस टेक अ क्वेश्चन सपोज सिक्स अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स डेट डेट डेस टिल इन्फिनिटी दिस इज गिवेन एंड द क्वेश्चन सेंग सॉल्व सिक्स अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स टिल इन्फिनिटी एंड द क्वेश्चन रिटर्न सॉल्व तो इन दिस केस हाउ टू सॉल्व वी आर नॉट फाइंडिंग द वैल्यू ऑफ रूट सिक्स विद द हेल्प ऑफ कैलकुलेटर सो प्रोसेस इज लेट x इक्वल टू अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स प्लस अंडर रूट सिक्स डेट डेट एस टिल इन्फिनिटी सिंस दिस इज गोइंग टिल इन्फिनिटी मीन्स इट विल बी रनिंग टिल इन्फाइनाइट सो वेन वी राइट स्क्वायरिंग बोथ साइड वेन वी राइट स्क्वायरिंग बोथ साइड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट एवर दिस काइंड ऑफ सिचुएशन इज गिवेन एंड द क्वेश्चन सेंग सॉल्व इट मीन्स वी हैव टू गिव दिस वैल्यू इज इक्वल टू सम वेरिएबल एक्स so let x equal to this after writing this a general behavior ki whenever x is equal to something is given in which in the in the form of square root so first of all we do with the help of squaring both side this is still is important so squaring both side it become x square when we are putting the square since this equation is running till infinity and putting the square so first under root is removed it becomes 6 plus and this will be again under root 6 Under root six, under root six, that that does till infinity. So now you will notice this again. In place of this, we can write again x. So it becomes x square is equal to six plus x. Because when something is squaring this side from the infinity, nothing is happened to be changed. So in place of this, we can again write x. Now x square minus x minus six equal to zero. This forming a quality equation. Previously, you will know, see there is no quality is appear when we putting equal to x, squaring both side and simplify. We are getting a quality equation. Now, it further simplify by using a splitting middle term. So it can be right x square minus three x plus two x minus six equal to zero. So this is a pair and this is a pair. In this pair, x will take common x minus three plus two will take common x minus three. So first bracket x minus three and second bracket x plus two equal to zero. So x equal to three and x equal to minus two. So this is the value of this type of equation to be solved. So this kind of questions. So this is a pattern. In a same way, one more question we will take. Suppose if this question is written in this manner. x equal to the question is x is equal to under root three plus under root three plus under root three that that does till infinity. In the previous question, this is not given. So we have put it is equal to x. In this, it is directly given x is equal to this. So in the same manner again, squaring both side, squaring both side, it become x square when we remove this. Putting the square, first square root is cancelled three, and it is under root three plus under root three plus under root three. That that does till infinity. So x square is equal to three plus. In place of this, again we can write x. So x square minus x minus three is equal to zero. So again it will be factorized by using C D R C H A R. X is equal to minus b plus minus b square. Minus 4ac to 4t is 12 upon 2. So x is equal to 1 plus minus under root 13 by 2. So x is equal to 1 plus under root 13 by 2 and x equal to 1 minus under root 13 by 2. So this is the way we can solve this type of problem. So this is the you can say a second type of question when some equation is running till infinity. 
तो इफ इट इज गिवन इक्वल टू एक्स इट्स गुड इफ इट इज नॉट गिवन तो वी हैव टू टेक फर्स्ट इक्वल टू एक्स देन स्क्वायरिंग बोथ साइड एंड देन सिंप्लीफाई दिस इज द सेकेंड टाइप ऑफ प्रॉब्लम नाउ नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन सपोज आवेशन इज गिवेन लाइक एक्स एक्स प्लस टू एक्स प्लस थ्री एक्स प्लस फोर नाउ यू विल सी एक्स एक्स प्लस टू एक्स प्लस थ्री एक्स प्लस फोर इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटी टू इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटी टू सॉरी इट इज एक्स एक्स प्लस टू एक्स प्लस थ्री एक्स प्लस फाइव इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटी टू तो इन दिस केस यू विल सी वन ब्रैकेट अदर बैकेट दे आर थ्री बैकेट एंड विल मल्टीप्लाई बाई एक्स इफ सिंपली क्वेश्चन सेम सॉल्व सो यू आर डूइंग अ चैप्टर क्वालिटी इक्वेशन फिर बट इफ दिस इक्वेशन इज अपियर तो अ जनरल बिहेवियर क्वालिटिक मीन्स ए एक्स स्क्वायर क्वालिटिक मीन्स ए एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस बी एक्स प्लस सी इज इक्वल टू जीरो बट दिस इक्वेशन इज नॉट लुक लाइक दिस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द पैटर्न ऑफ सॉल्विंग दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन तो वेन एवर द फोर फोर ब्रैकेट लाइक एक्स प्लस वन एक्स प्लस टू एक्स प्लस थ्री एंड एक्स इज इक्वल टू सपोज नाइंटी फाइव इज गिवेन या सपोज एक्स माइनस टू एक्स माइनस वन एक्स माइनस थ्री एंड एक्स माइनस फोर लाइक दिस इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटी टू इज गिवेन दीज आर द टू क्वेश्चन विच वी हैव टेकन द पैटर्न ऑफ दिस How to solve the method? First of all, we see x coefficient is always unity. Unity means one. If it is not one, so first we make it this x coefficient is one by taking common. So in this case, you will see x coefficient is already one. So the pattern of solving this type of question, the trick and the method is you will see the constant term two and the constant term is three. When these two constant term will add. So two plus three is five. Here nothing is constant appear. It means x plus zero or x minus zero. So zero plus five is five. It means these two brackets constant term sum is five and these two brackets constant term is five. So we have to search a pair in such a manner so that the constant term either add or subtract so that sum or difference is coming same. Like in this case one plus two and three. So in this case, you will see the constant term one and the constant term two. So two plus one three here x plus three. I mean x plus zero means zero plus three is three. So we will choose these two bracket and this two. In this case, minus one minus four. When we choose this minus one minus four, which gives minus five, and minus two and minus three, which gives minus five. So this is the way we can search how to write in bracket. So So whenever the four bracket is appear like this, so in this case we can do in this manner x and x plus five keep in bracket like this, and next bracket x plus two and x plus three means after identifying which two constant, two pair constant, sum or difference is same. So in this case two plus three sum is five, five plus zero. So we can keep these two terms in this bracket and these two terms in. This bracket. It further simplify x square plus five x. In this case, x square plus five x plus six. When x multiply by x square, two x, three x, five x plus six is equal to seventy two. After that, you will see x square plus five x is here. X square plus five x is here. So we will give x square plus five x is a new name is k. So this become k. And this become k plus six is equal to seventy two. So k square plus six k minus seventy two is equal to zero. Previously you will see quality equation is not appear. So this equation is transforming and simplifying. So you will see this is coming a quality equation. So it will be factorized either by splitting middle term or formula method. So k is equal to minus b. Minus six plus minus b square six squares thirty six plus four ac. So four two ja eight and four seven ja twenty eight upon two. It further simplify. 
it further simplify so k is equal to minus 6 plus minus 8 and 6 14 8 and 3 12 13 1 and it is 3 3 34 8 and 6 is 14 1 8 1 9 and 3 12 1 2 1 3 3 34 upon 2 3 34 is the square root of 18 18 square 18 square means 18 into 18 so when we multiply 8 8 the 64 6 8 1 the 8 and 6 14 and 1 8 1 4 2 and 3 it is coming 324 so 8 and 6 which is 14 and this is 2 so it is 324 so it is 324 here so k is equal to minus 6 plus minus 18 upon 2 so when we take k is equal to minus 6 plus 18 by 2 and k is equal to minus 6 minus 18 by 2 so k is equal to 12 by 2 k is equal to 6 and k is equal to minus 24 by 2 k is equal to minus 12 so these are the values of k these are the values of k but this is not the answer because we want the values of x so So in this case x square plus 5x is equal to k, x square plus 5x is equal to k, k means 6, when we put 6, so x square plus 5x minus 6 is 0, x square 6x minus x minus 6 is 0, x plus 6, x minus 1 is 0, x equal to minus 6 and x is equal to 1 and when x square plus 5x is equal to minus 12 because equal to k and the value of k is minus 12 when we substitute here so x square plus 5x plus 12 is equal to 0 it's not going to be factorized so we use formula x is equal to minus b minus 5 plus minus b square that is 25 minus 4ac so 12 for the 48 upon 2 so x is equal to minus 5 plus minus 853 it is 4 and 2, 23 minus 23 by 2. So it is square root of negative number. So we use i minus 5 plus minus under root 23i upon 2. So x is equal to minus 5 plus under root 23i by 2 and x is equal to minus 5 minus under root 23i by 2. So this is the values of x. So you have seen what ki when degree degree is representing number of roots so the question is x x plus 2 x plus 3 x plus 5 is equal to 72 so in this case you will see x x x x there are four x are appear if we multiply so the maximum degrees appear in this equation of the variable x is 4 so degree is 4 and degree is representing the number of solution that means number of roots so here it means four solutions are there if the solution is exist it means four solutions four roots are there so x is equal to minus 6 x is equal to 1 these two roots and x is equal to minus 5 plus 23i by 2 and this these two roots that's why four values of x is coming so here answer is x is equal to 6 minus 6 sorry x is equal to 1 and x is equal to minus 5 plus under root 23 i upon 2 and x is equal to minus 5 minus under root 23 i by 2. So this is the way we can solve this type of problem whenever the four brackets are appear and these brackets in product form. So first of all we will check the coefficient of x if coefficient of x is 1 then it's good if it is not 1 first make it 1 then try to make the sum of the constant values either sum or difference of the two pairs are same or not if same to keep it in one bracket and then multiply it and then choose a new variable and then simplify in this manner so i hope this concept is clear we will give the question to the worksheet so you can try to solve this kind of problem.